The third station, Jesus falls the first time. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. From the letter to the Hebrews. For the high priest we have is not incapable of feeling our weaknesses with us, but has been put to the test in exactly the same way as ourselves, apart from sin. From the letter to the Hebrews. Of course, any discipline is at the time a matter of grief, not joy. But later, in those who have undergone it, it bears fruit in peace and uprightness. So steady all weary hands and trembling knees and make your crooked paths straight. Then the injured limb will not be maimed. The initial enthusiasm with which Christ resolutely took up the cross is now being sorely tested. The weight of the cross, the blood he has lost, the horrific treatment of his body up to now have the combined effect of making the going one immense struggle. Lord, this is your first fall. But as you raise yourself with great effort from that dust, even here we see the seeds of resurrection beginning to sprout. In this scene, you speak to our hearts and say, Arise, O man, work of my hands. Arise, you who were fashioned in my image and have fallen. Arise. Lord, you desire to give us life to the full. Raise us out of dead ways and dead works. Raise us out of the dust of sin. Let us dust ourselves off, turn with confident resolution towards you, and continue walking. Give us strength, Lord, to walk that journey of faith. We are weak, and so we do not expect that we will never fall again. But Lord, when we fall, give us the faith and hope to always rise again relying on your merciful love. Give us the strength we need to continue on. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I love you, my Jesus, my love above all things. I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will.